My name is Bruce Fowle, founding principal of FX Fowle Architects. I collaborated with Renzo Piano on the design of the New York Times building. This is a building that will tread very lightly on the natural environment. Its exterior screen wall, consisting of horizontal ceramic tubes supported 16 inches outside the glass, will reduce the solar gain, while enabling daylight to penetrate deep into the workplaces through floor-to-ceiling clear glass. A unique integrated system of daylight dimming and roll-down shades developed through six months of analysis in a full-scale mock-up located at the New York Times Queens printing plant will greatly reduce energy consumption while providing a glare-free, flexible working environment. Retractable automated louvers provide solar control over the two-story atrium in the New York Times newsroom. A cogeneration plant is located at the east end of the podium. Serving the 24-7 portion of the New York Times operation, this highly efficient energy system will reduce the load on the city's electrical grid while reducing the required backup systems to maintain operation. The express structural system with its diagonal bracing greatly reduced the steel tonnage while adding rigor and interest to the facade. The building incorporates the first major installation in New York of an underfloor air distribution system. By advancing this technology, the system will reduce ductwork, lower the velocity and raise the temperature of the air entering the space, while providing cleaner air for the occupants. These, along with its many other sustainable features, will make this one of the most environmentally friendly buildings in the U.S.